Hi, welcome to this course on AWS Developer Tools. I am Kalyan Reddy. I am a solution architect with experience in designing, architecting, implementing the cloud solutions on AWS, Azure and Google platform. I will be the instructor for you in this course. In this course, we will primarily focus on the following four AWS Developer Tools. AWS Code Commit, AWS Code Build, AWS Code Deploy and AWS Code Pipeline. CodeStar, Cloud9, X-Ray are out of scope for this course. We are going to practically implement and understand about every service in detail. Let's start with code commit. For code commit, as a developer, we are going to build a simple REST application using Spring Boot. And then we'll check in that code to local Git repo. And we will create a repository in code commit. And then we'll push that code to code commit. In addition, we are also going to explore other code commit features like notifications, pull requests, commit visualizer. In the same way, for code build, we are going to reference the source as code commit and create or run builds in code build. And the artifacts get stored in the S3 service. So we are also going to extensively discuss about the buildspec.yaml and how to run the builds in code build service. For code deploy service, we are going to pick the build generated by code build and then we will deploy that to the EC2 instance. We will also understand and create appspec.yaml, lifecycle events for code deploy and we are also going to create scripts for the lifecycle events like install phase, before install, after install, startup, shutdown, etc. So, when coming to code pipeline, we are going to create a code pipeline by using other three developer tools, code commit, code build and then code deploy. We will also add two more new stages in this uh, pipeline for manual approval and then deploy to production servers to better understand the pipeline stages. From all these four services perspective, the scope is limited to EC2 instances. Elastic Container Services, ECR and Lambda are out of scope for this course for now. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye. Thank you.